I've tried to go a little bit smarter with this one and show you a way that you can kind of dress up a little bit more but still keep it a little bit more smart casual which I feel like I mention in every single outfit so you guys know by now that's my vibe. So first up we have this blazer which is from Zara. I also have this in gingham and it comes in like a few different prints and colours. I wear a medium in this one just because I like it to be a little bit more oversized and longer because I find Zara blazers, sometimes they come up okay, sometimes they're really big and personally I like wearing them into autumn as well as a kind of more of a jacket so I like being able to fit jumpers and stuff underneath and wear it a little bit more slouchy. So yeah, got this in a medium. This is actually a fine knit top from H&M, so it's like a t-shirt, but it's a really nice like fine jumper style, so really great for slightly colder days or if you've got an early morning meeting or something like that and it's just that little bit of nip in the air and you just want something a little bit more comfy and cosy. These shorts are, oh, losing the bag. <laughs> These shorts are from Mango a couple of years ago. I will leave similar linked because there's a lot of similar ones on the internet. But I've had these in my wardrobe for a really long time and I absolutely love them. They're just like a really nice kind of classic tailored style. And they've got little pockets on the side but really nice length, really easy to wear. And I will try my hardest to find as similar as I can because they're gorgeous. And I honestly have had them for I think about five years now and they just keep coming back year upon year when it gets a bit warmer. Bag wise I've gone for my little Gucci, don't know the name of this one, I can't remember for the life of me what the name of it is but I bought this second hand on eBay and I've seen all the receipts and stuff so I know it's legit but I don't know the exact name of it, all I know is that it was purchased in about 2004 or 5, I can't remember which one it was but it's an older one and I love it so much. And then shoes, obviously the Doc Martin Griffin quads. These are my favourite summer sandals, as I say all the time. And they're just honestly the most comfortable, easy to wear thing ever. And this is probably one of my favourite outfits at the moment for just like a nice brunch or dinner or, to be honest, just meetings when life goes back to normal a little bit because it's just really easy to wear and really comfortable. Okay, this outfit is definitely one that is a little bit smarter and I really like it. I definitely think if you're buying tailored shorts you need to embrace the smarter looks as well as trying to dress them down. So I've gone for these classic espadrilles which just naturally go with something a bit smarter anyway and I really love them. Then bag wise we've got this little mini Pauline. This is the, I believe, dust grey, I can't remember, but I'll leave it linked down below with the exact colourway so you can check it out. But this is the number one nano and it's gorgeous. Then the shirt I'm wearing is H&M, it's a size small, it's one of the classic Oxford shirts, so a little bit thicker. And it's just a really nice easy slouchy shirt, so I've just ruched the sleeves up and just left it a bit open so you can see the necklace underneath. And then for jewellery, I've just got these earrings and necklace from Mint Velvet, which is just classic gold. And then all my rings are H&M. But I honestly love this. This is the kind of thing that I think would work really well for brunch, for meetings, for just kind of every day. If you are going to the office, you could definitely wear this. So many occasions. And I think anything that you would naturally wear something smart casual for, this would work really well. And it's also something you could even wear on holiday. Like I would probably wear this on holiday if I was going to dinner at a slightly fancier restaurant. And it's just really simple to wear and really classic. This outfit is definitely one that I am loving at the moment. So it is very, very classic, very simple. Basically just got my black Doc Martin Jaden boots, which are my most worn ever. I've got white tailored shorts on, of course. And then I've got this oversized blazer, which is really old ASOS. I've linked the similar version down below, but this is very, very old. And then I've got my little coach bag, which is the Cassidy. I got this in Bista Village and I've only ever seen it in Outlet. So if you want to get your hands on it, it's, mm, I don't know if it will still be there, but it was always just in outlets whenever I've seen it. So I'll link the newer version of it, but that is where you'll find it. And then I've got mint velvet and H&M jewellery on. This is actually an open back top from Zara, which ties at the back, but I really like the high neck long sleeve detailing and I thought it just went really well. So I popped it on, even though you can't see the back of it, I just thought it looked really cute and I kind of love the simplicity of this outfit. I just think it's definitely one that I'd wear every day, going for lunch with friends, going out and about, and just kind of everyday things really. I guess the only place you couldn't really wear it is to work if you worked in an office, but other than that, really, really cute. This one is definitely borderline smart casual, borderline I'm off to the beach, but I love it and these sandals come out a lot for me in summer because they're just so cute and comfortable. They're just little rope numbers from Nomadic State of Mind, which I got via and other stories a couple of years ago and I really like them. They're completely rope, so like even the bottom's rope, but they're really sustainable and they're honestly just the comfiest thing ever. 
And then I've got my Loewe bag, which I use all the time because I think it's just complementing with the basket and then the rope sandals. Obviously got the shorts on here. Obviously I've got my little cream tailored shorts on here. I've got a little white t-shirt, which is again from Another Stories. Blazer is a Zara one that I'm wearing in a medium. And then I've just got some mint velvet and H&M jewellery, which I'll leave linked as well. This is a great look for if you've got a summer barbecue or you've got something a little bit more chilled, like going to the shops or something, because the rope sandals are great. Definitely more of a heat wave outfit, but the rope sandals are a really great addition to a wardrobe. And I wear them when I travel all the time. And then obviously the bag as well. I also wear a lot, but... I just think it's a really cute kind of summer barbecue, having dinner in the garden with friends kind of vibe, especially because it's just very chilled and something I would 1000% wear when it finally gets above 10 degrees. <laughs> okay, next outfit is this one. So again, keeping it a little bit more smart, definitely something I'd wear for a dinner or drinks in the evening and something a little bit smarter. So basically just dressing up the shorts because I think tailored shorts, like I've said before, can definitely go from being really casual to really smart. And this is how I would personally wear them smarter. I literally live in this outfit in Turkey. It was really, really lovely and really just easy to wear. So I've got this black vest from H&M, which is really comfortable, really easy. Just a classic rib vest that I think everyone should own because it goes with everything. Blazer wise, this one is from ASOS. It's really old but I'll link the newer version of it. I've got my Marc Jacobs snapshot bag here, which is in the shade French Grey. Again, I will leave it linked and I'll also leave my what fits in my bag video because I did review this and share what fits and it's a surprising amount more than you'd think. And then on my feet, we have these little mules, which are from Autumn in Topshop and they sold out really quick and I've never seen them since, but they're honestly just some of my favorite heels because they're really minimal, really classic and they just kind of, Add that little something, so like they could definitely go from day to night really easily and you could wear them to the office or you could equally wear them out to a bar or something as well. But this one, like I said, is definitely one that I would wear more for a smart occasion. So meetings in the evening, drinks with friends, going to fancy restaurants, that kind of thing. And I just really like it. Okay, next up is this one, which I'm kind of obsessed with because it's just really classic, really casual and really easy to wear. So on my feet, we've got the H&M chunky trainers that I wear quite a lot. They're about £20, really comfortable, really easy to wear. And then... Clothes wise, I've got the white tailored shorts on, of course. I've got this little vest, which is from H&M. It's quite old, but I'll see if I can find it. It's just like a really nice ribbed one. And then I've got this jacket from Mango, which I got back in autumn. I've actually done a ways to style on this, which I'll leave linked because I styled it up not that long ago, actually, but I might do an updated one for like spring and autumn time. That's a little bit more versatile for like warmer weather because it is really comfortable. And then bag wise, I've got this one from Zara, which is just a really lovely quilted number. I'll leave the H&M one linked because this one is quite often out of stock. I think it only comes back in if there's a return and the H&M one is really affordable. I think it's about the same price and exactly the same quality. So I'll leave it linked, but this is just a really nice outfit for every day. Like I would wear this kind of here, there and everywhere. Definitely wouldn't limit it to being like pub garden or just barbecues or something. It's just really easy to wear and really comfortable. And it also brings the tailored shorts down a bit. So like it makes them a bit more casual, which I really like because I think if I can style something at least five ways in my wardrobe, then it stays and it gets worn a lot. So that's why these are still going strong about five years later. 